prefer the ones on Facebook. Oh, uh, if you get the ones on NC. Yeah, I, I, I got it. I just got to go get the Okay. Yeah. 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 Y'all gonna tape it? I asked Rodney, said he would. If you give him one, he'll do it. Okay, I didn't know if I just leave it up here. Good morning, everybody. Thank you so much for coming. On behalf of the commissioners and myself, I'd like to welcome everybody to Windsor. We are here to celebrate our 250th anniversary. Very few communities in the United States can do that. We were chartered before there was the United States. I really, there's been a lot of work put into this. I really want to thank the 250th committee. They've been working on it for over a year now and have done a tremendous job. Also, I'd like to thank the town employees. They have really cleaned the whole town up and it looks, really looks good. One group I really would like to thank, and I don't think any of them are living, but it's the 200th committee, 200th uh, anniversary committee. They didn't have the blueprint that we had this time and they didn't have any money. The town didn't have any money. The merchants paid for the celebration then. They just raised the money. And also, I'd like to thank all the veterans that are here. You're the reason we're here and why we can get out and celebrate and uh, enjoy a nice day. I have some well wishes from a number of places around the United States. The town of Windsor, Vermont, Windsor, Virginia, Windsor, Colorado, Windsor, Connecticut, Windsor, California, and Windsor, Wisconsin. They all sent uh, their best wishes, and many of them sent gifts. So we really appreciate that. And there's one particular, one particular letter I'd like to read to you. I send my greetings to those celebrating the 200th anniversary of the town of Windsor, North Carolina. For 200 years, 250 years, the town of Windsor has contributed to the unique American story of freedom and democracy. I am grateful to your community's enduring spirit, which strengthens our nation, honors our past, and ensures the promise of American greatness for future generations. Melania joins me in sending our best wishes for a joyous celebration. Donald J. Trump, President of the United States. The original to that is going to be matted and framed in a nice way and put on the wall in the town hall forever, I hope. And lastly, whereas the 250th anniversary of, of the founding of the town of Windsor, North Carolina, will be celebrated on t November 10th, 12th, 10th through 12th, 2018, and whereas an event of such importance should be recognized and celebrated, and whereas the citizens of the town of Windsor, through their honest hard work and dedication, have built upon that rich historic foundation first established by their forefathers, and have in that same spirit of historic consciousness labored to ensure that Windsor remains a thriving community, and whereas the town of Windsor has contributed to the history of this area, and we are proud of this heritage. Now therefore, as mayor of the town of Windsor, I hereby proclaim November 10th through 12th, 2018, as days of recognition and celebration of our past and future. James F. Hoggard, Mayor of Town of Windsor, November 10th, 2012, 2018. Now I'd like to call on Commissioner Randy Walston to give a prayer to kick off our celebration, to kick off our celebration. Thank you, Mayor. Let us pray. Father, we just humble ourselves before you. Lord, we recognize your greatness and your mercy. Lord, we uh, pause on this uh, the eve of uh, this great day, uh, Lord, where we remember our veterans, uh, those who fought and uh, gave the ultimate sacrifice, uh, those who uh, served, and Lord, uh, just to, uh, to make this a better community, a better nation, uh, Lord, we uh, certainly recognize them. We pray that you continue to add your blessing on all these veterans. Uh, Lord, we also ask that you continue to uh, bless this community. We pray that, uh, that through the rest of our years that uh, you'll keep a hedge of protection around us. Lord, we pray that everything that we do, everything that we say, will bring honor and glory to your name. It's in Jesus Christ's name we ask this. Amen.
Again, thank you all for coming, and we are now kicking off our celebration. We are underway. Thank you. Couldn't find you out there. Thank you so much. Great, thank you for that. Uh, don't forget all of the vendors we have back here. We appreciate them coming. And also, we have a video inside about the 250th. I think it just got here yesterday, so I've only seen a little bit of it, but I'm told it's really good. So uh, if you get a chance, just step into the commissioner's room there. And uh, any, any of you commissioners have anything? Kids stuff over on Brown Street. The, all of the kids rides and things of their interest are over on Granville Street near the park and pretty much everything today is in a pretty concise area right around here so it's not hard to find any of it and uh, I think that's about it. Do y'all have anything? Tom right. Tomorrow at five o'clock at the Episcopal Church Even Song will be there and they sing period music the period being uh, around the time of the founding of this town. So everyone is invited, and uh, I, I've heard that's a really good good show. So, again, thank you for coming. Ann wants to mention that the book, the new book is at my museum. Volume 2. Okay. The, is it a draft, Russ? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, those of you that were around for the 200th will remember that we had a commemorative book uh, it was the committee published that book. They had to raise the money for it themselves. The town didn't even have the money for it. So we have one now that this committee has put together, and uh, it's a color book. Uh, Russ, at Russ Russell's museum, there's a draft copy you can see. It looks like a finished product, but I understand they've still got some editing and a few additions to make. So uh, it's well worth seeing. There at high school? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, and the video was put together by Janice Riggs and her group at the high school, the uh, graphic students. They did a really good job on it. It looks professional. So, uh, anyway, thank you all for coming, and let's have a good time today.
David.